Hi there, this is Rohan and today I am going to unbox the new LG Smart TV whose model number is 32LJ573D TV. Actually this TV has not yet launched but uh, I have got, uh, got it somehow and uh, today I am going to unbox um, this TV. So let's start unboxing it. Let's see what we get in the box. It's very tightly packed so... We can see a wire which I am sure that uh, it needs to be connected with the adapter and uh, yeah this is the adapter for the TV and what is this uh, this is a stand for the TV yeah yeah this is a stand for the TV now I'm sure we must get another one. Yeah, this is the another stand for the TV. And uh, yep, that's it. And now we get the TV. Now I'll have to open the TV. So this is the TV we've got a bag in the box so let's check it out what is there in this bag this is a remote control for the smart TV for the smart LG TV and let's see what's other things we have the batteries but these are very low quality batteries for the remote control and uh, this is the belt which uh, I don't know what is the use of this belt these are the screws which uh, are used to fit the TV and these are the paperwork which in consists of quick startup guide and the demo check sheet the LG safety and reference manual and the LG quick guide reference sheet yeah so that's it in the box yeah so this is the TV now let's see how the TV looks The design quality is superb. We get uh, two USB port, one HDMI port, one LAN port, one output port, audio output port, and one headphone jack and a power cable, power port to connect to the power. Now this is a 32 inch LG smart 3D TV and I think the thickness of this TV is very big in size but uh, this must not be an issue now these are the speakers for the TV the back of the TV is a metallic and it feels a very premium quality when you use it or when you touch the TV yeah so overall it's a very good TV and now let's check it out how it works so let's start using this TV so guys this is the TV LG Smart 3D TV as you can see the picture quality is very good and very classy and when you see it it feels very premium quality of a TV it has various functions such as now it I am showing about the YouTube it is already pre-installed and uh, 
it looks very similar when you browse it through your laptop or a web browser or when you use it in a mobile app you can also search various channels and various videos for example i'm searching about uh, ipl 2017 now i'm going to play a video now you all all of you can see this see that this video is being played on youtube yeah the image quality is very good and uh, the picture quality is also very good there is no kind of uh, delay or what you can say the pixels are not getting spread it works on ultra hd quality and now the next feature about this video is live tv guys i'm facing a problem while using live tv as it shows that uh, it is not programmed so i'll have to solve this error with the lg store and then i'll get back with you with the answer moving on further guys i'm not showing about the amazon and the netflix app because this app requires update and the lg tv has pre installed 512 mb of storage so i am not updating the app it looks very similar while using in your laptop or when you are using in your desktop or in a mobile app the next is the hangama app which is a music app it's uh, very similar when you use it in your mobile phone or laptop now you can see if you have your user name and password then you can sign it in the hangama app this this app is only already pre installed in the lg tv now moving on further we have the web browser this is a default web browser for the lg tv it uh, contains uh, everything what you type and uh, it also provides suggestions and uh, everything what you do in your google chrome browser or a mozilla firefox now i have searched for the quick buzz to get the latest scores about the match and as you all can see it's very good now i can also browse on google moving on further we have the user guide if you want to understand your tv and know about it thoroughly then you can use the user guide menu it has a complete guidance about the tv how to use it and uh, how to keep safety and all the stuff now the next is about the mm, images and the videos which are pre installed in the tv now as you all can see these are the pre installed images yeah the qu image quality is very good as uh, the images are displayed on 1920 by 1080 pixels very good quality now the next option is about the setting now i'll show some of the setting such as the picture mode aspect ratio surround sound timer safety and many other stuffs now we'll look at this one by one 
this is the picture menu which consists of the picture mode settings the energy saving you can keep it on and uh, the eye comfort mode which uh, automatically turns the temperature of the color which feels uh, very comfortable for your eyes and uh, many other stuff the next is the sound menu the sound menu consists of the sound mode settings sorry actually i'm using it first time so i'm also a little bit confused so let's get back to it yeah so the sound mode settings consist of the standard gaming cricket surround sound or many of the options which you use also in your mobile applications the equalizer and the virtual surround plus you can enable them manually next is the program program tuning and manager and advisor which are of no use the network is uh, which tells you that you are connected to the wireless sorry wireless connection if you have an ethernet lan or an ethernet cable then you can connect it to the ethernet port of the tv the next it also consists of the wifi direct for transferring files the next menu is the general which uh, consists of the eco mode and uh, standby light timers locations etc the eco mode is used for power saving consumption we you can enable it manually when you want simple link hdmi cec which you can enable when you connect hdmi cable the next menu is uh, about the safety where you can uh, keep the screen lock uh, which is similar to you when you use the mobile app the next is the accessibility it consists of audio description subtitles it also uh, shows the subtitles of the movies and uh, audio files etc menu transparency it is similar when you use your windows laptop moving on yeah so we have a screen cast by enabling this you have to connect the screen cast from your mobile to the tv so you can see whatever you can do in your mobile in your tv now let's say i have connected the mobile here is the remote i am using the lg smart tv remote you can download it from the description this is my oneplus one mobile it works very fine and there is no type of delay when you use between the mobile and the tv so and the quality of the picture is very good also the pixels are not spreading away the pixel factor uh, spreading factor is very low as you can see i have played a game on the tv using my mobile phone and there is no kind of delay now moving on the next is the music which consists of the pre installed music by the lg itself i have not installed or i have not uh, stored any of the music in the lg tv so these are the sample music
these are the sample music four sample music which are given by the LG I must say the animation for this TV is very good very smooth no kind of lagging or nothing about to worry about this TV now the next is uh, to set the picture mode to standard or cinema or cricket or any other mode if you want to set manually you can set it so and next is the aspect ratio which uh, is similar when you use the camera in your phone so next is the surround sound if you wish to enable it then you can turn on the next uh, is the surround sound the surround sound uh, enables you to use external speakers or headphone jack or uh, audio output or the wireless headphones in place of LG speakers so this is a great feature I liked it and the next is the sleep timer which you can set it manually the next is the sef safety feature where you can keep the screen lock similar when you use it in your mobile phones to lock the screen similar you have to enter a password when you turn on the TV yep so that's it about the TV if you wish to know something else further about this TV then you can post it in my comment section if you like my video then hit like the but hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel for more updates thank you